I haven't done a pick video in a really long time and I've had a few people asking me who do I think is going to win the Masters. So since the Masters is back this week, I thought I would make one. Now, usually when I make these videos, well, a long time ago, I used to get pretty deep. I used to look at the last five previous winners, their winning formula, then I would see who's leading in those stats currently in the season, on the PGA Tour, the European Tour. I would look at the top 25, probably from the last like three years, see if there's any consistencies with that. I would go in and I would look at every stat available to me. This year, I'm being a little bit lazy. I asked Instagram, who do you think's gonna win the Masters? So I'm gonna run through what you guys said and I'm gonna give you my opinion on the players that you've picked and tell you if they are worth a bet. Okay, so let's have a look and see what you guys said. Uh, Justin Thomas come up a couple of times, um, played four times, made the cup four times. I think his highest finish is 12th. So definitely worth a bet. Tiger, I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate for this, but no, he is not gonna do it. He gave us the absolute dream last year, but not this year. Uh, Tony Finau, um, yeah, like he's played twice. He's had really good finishes. I think he dislocated his ankle in 2017 and finished inside the top 10, which is pretty impressive. <laughs> Sandy Lyle. I don't actually know if Sandy Lyle's playing. I'm not too sure, I'm gonna double check that. But, you know, living the dream, wins a couple of majors and just rocks up every year. I don't think he's made the cut in a really long time though. So let's not put a bet on him. Okay, Colin Morikawa. I think I've totally butchered that name, but you know, the current PGA champion already proved he's a major winner, but this is his first appearance at Augusta, so don't think he's a solid bet. DJ, a lot of people have said DJ. Uh, keep away from stairs. Uh, I think that was also a 2017 moment. He fell down the stairs and had to pull out, and that's when he was the current number one. So as long as you keep him away from that, um, he could be a decent shout. Wolf. Another one, great player, but it's his first Masters. And Augusta is a course that you have to know. And I think you need to have a couple under your belt before that you actually do win a green jacket. Definitely gonna win one, I'm sure of it, but not this year. Phil? Uh, I don't think Phil's gonna do it, but if we could make him up this week, that would be fantastic. John Rams come up a few times, obviously likes Augusta, top 10 last year. Uh, Tyrrell, I don't know. I can't wait to see a hoodie at Augusta though. I'm really looking forward to that. <sighs> Ricky likes the Masters, but hasn't made a cut since January. So I wouldn't put money on him. Uh, and then of course, the one that is coming up time and time again is Bryson. Now, he was my pick for the US Open, and I was delighted about that, obviously. We've seen all the videos of him carrying, I think it's like 326 yards on the Augusta range, and he is gonna play this course in a completely different way than we've ever seen before. But I just don't think it's a course that you can do that on. I just see him spending a lot of time in the trees, and I think it's a course that you really have to, you know, manage your way around. And I don't know, I'm probably completely wrong, but I just don't see him winning the green jacket. Now, let's talk about my two picks. My first pick is Xander. So a lot of people have said him and I'm not surprised. Um, he's also the other guy that I put money on in the US Open. Um, I put him each way, so not bad. Got a little bit of cash from him. Um, he's played in 13 majors and seven of those have been in the top 10. So I just know he's gonna win a major at some point. I think it would be great for it to happen this week because I've got money on him, but it's definitely coming. Like, just wait, this guy is gonna win a major. And I think that when he does, 
he's gonna win a couple. So my last pick is Rory McIlroy. This pick might be a little bit more heart than head. I just wanna see him get that career grand slam. I'd love to see him do it. It's, uh, it's kind of a feeling he's always the bridesmaid. You know, he's the last six years, he's only finished outside the top 10 once at Augusta. Is maybe the event being played in November gonna go in his favor and he's finally gonna win that elusive green jacket? Fingers crossed, that's who my money's on. So Xander and Rory are my top two picks. Comment below and let me know what you think of everything that I've said. I'm sure there's a few people that'll have opinions out there, but please let me know who your money's on and what you think. Give me a big thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this and please hit that subscribe button.